This is a story of positive externalities of production. Have you ever wondered how much do cows fart? Let's ask Bessie. Bessie here is a cow. Her farts account for 1.07 times 10 to the negative 7th percent of greenhouse emissions in the world. Let's multiply that by 1.3 billion. That's how many cow cows are in the world. When she farts, she releases methane gas. Cow farts account for 14% of all greenhouse gases. Greenhouse gases can cause global warming and harm our world. And this is positive externalities of production. Right across the street from the farm that Bessie lives in, there is a cow research and development center. This firm produces all kinds of cow products that the firm buys. Recently, there has been a new discovery of a magical cow pill that turns methane into glucose, ultimately preventing Bessie and her peers from releasing methane when they fart. Just to test out the pill, the scientists from the firm give an initial batch of pills to the cow farm. It was a massive success as Bessie and her peers stopped farting as much methane. After the huge success, the firm started selling the pills. However, the prices were too expensive. The farmers had no incentives to buy the pills, as they would practically get nothing out of the product. Cows farting less methane would not affect their production in any way. And this is when the government steps in. By providing subsidy to these firms, the government ultimately lowers the cost of these pills, increasing its demand among farmers. This would shift the MPC curve closer to the MSC curve, making use of the potential welfare gain. Also, the government could promote these pills by setting up advertisements. Cow pills good, no pills bad. This would shift the MSB outwards. Regardless of the costs involved in this research and development, society is going to benefit immensely from less methane reducing the risks of global warming and other natural disasters. Thank you for watching.